Hey guys, it's Agatardi2744, and today I'm going to show you how to get SBR Rotator, or SB Rotator for free, on the iPhone, iPod Touch, or I guess, the yeah, iPad, which the iPad really doesn't need this, but for the iPhone and iPod Touch, this is for you guys. Basically, you just saw what it can do right there. Uh, it's customizable, so you don't have to have the apps overlap if you don't like that. So first thing you want to do is go ahead and enter Cydia. It's free, like I said. I'm just going to go ahead and skip through because it takes a while to open up Cydia. So once City is opened up here, I want you to manage, sources, edit, add, and then I'm going to have a, a code to the left here. Just go ahead and type that in as it says, exactly as it says, and then click add source. Once it adds the source, just go ahead and click done, and then it'll say sinful iPhone, uh, sinful iPhone repo right there. If it doesn't say that, you need to re-enter the code so it does. Then you want to go to search, right here, type in S B R. Now S B R and then S B R rotator right here should show up. It'll be called S B R Rotator Cracked. Now if you download this one from Big Boss, the original one, you're gonna have to pay for it. If you want it for free, you go ahead S B R Rotator Cracked. So once this opens up here, I've already downloaded it, so as you can see it says modify, but you want to click install here and then you'll get it and as you can see it's sinful iPhone icon right there and I'll say SPS rotator there so basically like I said it'll allow you to rotate your main screen sorry about the reloading data here so all you do is click install and it'll install automatically and then it'll restart winter board for you Alright, so then you can go ahead and exit out of Cydia. Then you're going to have the regular screen as you can see right here. The only real difference is up here you're going to see the spinny thing right there. And basically that's a quick way to be able to shut it off and turn on your rotator. So if you don't like it, you can just shut it off. And if you do like it, keep it on. Uh, so what it's going to allow you to do is as you can see right here, it allows you to simply rotate your applications. And mine are overlapped as you can see right here. Um, but they are all clickable. They're all clickable. Uh, and then you can rotate it all four ways. And stuff like that. So, that's SB Rotator. And if you go to your settings, if you don't like the uh, settings that it comes as default, you can go all the way down and go to SPS Rotator, and there are t fully customizable settings here. There's hundred, not hundreds, but there's lots of settings on the SPS Rotator here, Springboard Rotator settings. Uh, so you can just mess with that and get the exact one that you want. And as you can see, there aren't that much stalling. They pretty much fixed all the bugs. There used to be lots of bugs, but they pretty much fixed them all. It's a really nice setup. The apps don't have to be like that, and as you can see, the letters do overlap underneath them right there. Uh, so the app titles, you can take those app titles off, or you can fix that and stuff with the Springboard SB Rotator settings. So thank you guys for watching. This is Katari2744. If you did not see the code, uh, it'll be to the left, as well as the subscribe button. Be sure to click the subscribe annotation, uh, because I just started this channel, and it'll help the channel grow. So thank you guys for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. This has been our iGuitarD2744.